so this is our setup here. We've got uh, one, two, three, four nails in the tree. Let's zoom in on one. Each nail brings up the uh, amperage that's going out of the tree. It doesn't increase the voltage. The voltage more or less stays the same regardless of how many taps you have. And it doesn't seem to be too critical as to how high you have them up, but the higher you have them up, it seems the less potential you have. And this seems to be in the nominal uh, area. Now here we have the key element. We've got capacitors. We've got one, two, three, four, six. five. Six of them. Six. Six capacitors hooked up. 1,000 UF. 1,000 microfarads. I guess. UF. Um, US micro. Six volts DC. Yes. Electrolytic. Uh, Looks like I got them zoomed in. Okay. So, and then we got them hooked up to the uh, meter, which right. is... Right. And when we first put them on, they were reading almost like zero, and they finally got up, got up to about 0.6 uh, volts. So they're charged up to 0.6 volts, and in theory, if we put them in series, we'll start getting multiples of the 0.6 volts. Okay, can you turn that to... What's that siren? Is that the uh, energy police? <laughs> I think they're trying to shut us down. Now this is then hooked up to the uh, shovel here. The shovel is the ground, which is pretty convenient. There. And uh, obviously, we, if we had a better ground, it would be better. But this is this is working. So so this is not optimized yet. This is not optimized either. Probably are the uh, you want to switch that to a microfarad? It's to good a, enough. Oh, if, we, if we do, it'll burn amps? out. It'll drain all the. Oh, it will. Okay, current. we don't want to do that. All right. So okay. you want to you want to stop. You want to stop.